Well, the coronavirus has hindered the release date of some films. Which films do you ask? Well, let's talk about it. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Nerd News. I'm your host, Chris Chavis. And with me is my co-host, Chucky. So the movie business is an ongoing machine that just keeps pumping out projects after projects. Well, with the virus that has been going around, it has put a big pause on not just movies, but life in general. So several Hollywood productions have been put on pause, have been delayed because of this. And uh, th that's the topic of today's video, guys. But before we get into what films have been affected by this, if this is your first time here, hello, welcome. Uh, I would greatly appreciate it if you hit that subscribe, the like, and that little notification bell. Now that notification bell will notify you of all future episodes as I post them. So in light of this very serious situation revolving the coronavirus, The Hollywood Reporter has reported that uh, Hollywood will be hit with a $20 billion loss from this virus. I mean, some films have been hitting 30 to 50 million just depending on the project, but that is a lot of change. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of cheddar. That's a lot of cream. I'm using all these phrases that kids know. But with the loss of all that money, let's talk into the productions that, like I said, have been delayed. First up, we're gonna go to the suave, tuxedo wearing, shake of a knot stirred character in that of James Bond. So the latest film is called No Time to Die. It'll be postponed until November 2020. Now this film will mark the very last time that Daniel Craig will be the title role of 007, man. It's kind of sad. This film already had release date issues to begin with. So even before the virus came, uh, there was just a bunch of issues with actually releasing the movie out to us. But in light of everything that is going on, they, they paused that production indefinitely. And the original release date for this movie was April 2020. And the new release date, like I said, is November 25th, 2020. So we gotta wait a little bit for this film, but uh, you know, it's the very last in the Bond franchise. Daniel Craig is a pretty cool Bond. He's not my favorite, Sean Connery's my favorite. Yeah, sh shake and not stud. That's the best Connery I got, so we're gonna go with it. But we will see the movie when it comes out. So the next film, we're gonna hop over to Marvel and that of Black Widow. Now this solo adventure following Natasha and her whole backstory, you know, the one that has that red ledger in it. The film was originally slated to come out May 1st, 2020. But like a lot of movies on this list, which you'll find out, they haven't really announced a new release date yet for Black Widow. But there is a rumor floating out there in the uh, intersphere I can't think of any other pun besides like interweb, intersphere, the way, way beyond computer screen. I don't know. The rumor is uh, Black Widow will somehow be streaming on Disney+. Plus. You see this? This is a grain of salt. You probably should take that piece of news with one of these. I really don't see that happening uh, because, you know, they need to make, you know, a profit off of what they spent. You know, they need a good ROI with that one. So I really don't see that happening, but you know, if it does, Fantastic, Disney Plus, you rule. Next, we're gonna move on to the horror genre and that of A Quiet Place 2. So actor and director of this film, John Krasinski. Yes, that's right, John Krasinski, Jim from The Office. <laughs> I love that guy. So John tweeted on his personal Twitter account that this film will definitely be delayed. Now this film will schedule to come out May 20th, 2020 but no release date has been announced. So we'll just have to wait in silence for this film to come out. You know, wait in silence because that's the theme of the movie. You, you can't make a sound or the monsters will get you. Watch the first film, it was great. Next is the ninth film. That's right guys, the ninth film in this Fast and Furious franchise. That's right, Fast and the Furious 9. So Fast and Furious 9 was announced the same day as The Quiet Place 2 that it would also be delayed. So get this, the original release date was May 20th, 2020, right? But now the new release date is April 2nd, 2021. That's a long time to wait. So I guess at this point, you might want to put your muscle car in the garage, turn off the NOS and uh, just wait, man. You live your life one quarter mile at a time, but sometimes you gotta wait at that red light. Next, we're gonna move over to Disney and that of Mulan and a couple of other Marvel-related uh, projects. So first, we'll start with Mulan. 
Mulan is next in line to have the live action adaptation from the classic cartoons onto the big screen. So Mulan was set for March 27th, uh, but no release date has been announced yet as to what the, the new release is. And at the same time that Disney mentioned uh, Mulan would be delayed, uh, a couple of other TV shows that are on Disney Plus have also been put on pause, namely some of the Marvel shows, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, uh, and I believe Loki. But another one on that list was the brand new Marvel movie that is, if you don't know this character, you know, it's something that you are, aren't going to know the name right off your tongue like Iron Man. The movie is Shang-Chi. Now, Shang-Chi was already in the middle of production, like through smack dab in the middle of making this film. They had to put the movie on pause because the director of the film tested positive for the coronavirus. So he is isolated, the movie has been put on pause, and well, we are where we are. So a bunch of Disney shows are gonna come out at some point, but it's fine because we're all subscribed to Disney Plus. We're watching all the great things. We're waiting for The Mandalorian 2. Oh man, I don't know if The Mandalorian uh, season two is gonna be delayed. I need to look into that. And last but not least, we're gonna move on to <laughs> a movie that not just I, not just me, not just this host of this show, but everyone out there that loves action movies, that loves sci-fi movies, a movie that has changed the way that action scenes are filmed and the way that you question your own reality. That's right, The Matrix 4 has been delayed. Yeah, if you didn't know The Matrix 4 was actually happening, they just started filming. And yes, the whole cast is back. So the production on Matrix 4 started in February and the Wachowski sisters, they haven't really announced when they're gonna resume production of the <laughs> Gosh, the most anticipated action movie in a very long time. But once this movie starts resuming filming, all kinds of, you know, set photos are going to come out and set videos like a couple have came out. They're not, you don't really see much because, you know, it's a CGI like eye fest. But when the marketing starts for that movie, man, they're going to make that money back in no time. Guarantee it. But there are a slew of other movies that haven't had the chance to finish production and or actually release their movie. We're just gonna have to wait and see what movie that we're looking forward to to come out in the near future. But the reasoning for these productions to shut down makes total sense and I completely understand and I'm glad that they did shut down. I mean, you gotta protect not just the people that are working on the, those projects, but everyone else around them. So, you know, your life is more important than an entertainment piece. So, you know, take care of yourselves, everyone that was working on those projects, you know, this is a good time to learn your lines. But what movie are you looking forward to on this list? Let me know in the comments below. I wanna know what you think. And guys, if you enjoy this show, then please check out my social media account. That's the sister to this show. I have it on Instagram and Twitter. I update those daily so you know what's going on in comic book casting, movie news, uh, cast, uh, movie trailers. I mean, you name it, I have it on there. But guys, until next time, please wash your hands, take care of each other, have fun with, you know, uh, isolating is interesting but you know you can have fun with it laugh smile take care of yourself and watch as many movies as you possibly can guys ain't that right chucky yes that's correct